Well, Columbia police are still looking for one of the robbers who entered a barber shop, not knowing its employees and customers were ready and willing to defend it. News 19's Colby Gallagher visited the shop today to see how they're recovering. If you have people out there like that that's willing to do anything and to harm kids, then they show no regard for anyone like that. Not even 24 hours after two armed robbers walked into Next Up Barber Shop on Fort Jackson Boulevard, the business is packed with waiting customers, both young and old. Barber Brandon Dreer says the shop was a similar scene on Friday night when two masked men entered. Two men came in on with one, one with a handgun, one with a rifle, and came in to order everybody to put their hands up and force all the customers and kids to put their hands up and they were starting to go into everybody's pocket. Master Barber Al Murray Bookman and his customer did what the robbers asked, but what the masked men didn't know is that both Bookman and his client have concealed weapons permits. When he came to him for his money, he told him that his money was over there in the chair. And when the guy walked over to the chair, that's when he, he came out and shot. And when he started shooting, I came out and started shooting. The guy who got shot tried to go through the back door and it was jammed up and he ended up getting uh, shot again because the door was stuck. Columbia police say that man later died at a hospital. His partner was able to get out the front door and is still on the run. The barbers say their concern now is how the children who witnessed it all are recovering and want the person responsible for their fear caught. If you know him, you know, uh, turn him in, you know, because um, if you don't, you're going to do somebody else like that. And this time it could be an innocent victim getting killed. Colby Gallagher, News 19, WLTX. And if you know any information on where that other robber could be or who he is, you are asked to call Crime Stoppers at 1-888-CRIME-SC.